Hello, hello, my name is Basanta Das and welcome to my YouTube channel uh, where I dedicate myself uh, to empowering you with Vedic astrology so that you can know yourself and make better choices and also um, provide you with mantra healing and um, spirituality. So today I wanted to make a video about how to install Jagannath Aura software in a Mac. Uh, why? Because this software originally is just uh, running on Windows. So Pandit Narasimha Rao, who is the author of the software and a great astrologer, uh, he has made it only so that it can run on Windows. But um, if you have a Mac, uh, like I have a Mac, so um, you might be wondering, well, I'd be missing out on this piece of software. And uh, you don't have to. So there is a workaround, and I want to explain how to do it. So um, it's a very easy workaround. Um, what you're going to want to do is uh, open your browser. And uh, we're going to go over here to codeweavers.com. And uh, if we go ahead and just codeweavers.com, we're going to go ahead. You're going to see this window. So what you want to do here is uh, you want to go over here to Crossover Mac and hit the Download Trial button. So this will uh, take you to this window. You enter your um, email and your um, name and then you can download a trial it's free for 14 days and then if you want to keep the software you can go ahead and buy it for uh, 29.95 a year i do it every year uh, i want to give a disclaimer i'm not paid anything from uh, code weavers and crossover it's just the best solution i have found and i think it's totally worth the 29 dollars and I think it's totally worth the $29 uh, for the benefits it gives you. You can also run other uh, Windows applications through this, uh, you know, Code Weavers crossover. So it's not just limited to Jagannath Aura. So um, you go ahead and do that. Okay, so uh, you can download. Once you download, go ahead and run the Mac installer as you would install any other application. It's very straightforward. Uh, you don't need the tutorial for this. So just double click on the downloader. You can install it. And then once it's installed, um, you're going to want to go over here to um, VedicAstrologer.org, where is where you download the Jagannath Hora software. And you're going to want to go where it says here, Download. <clears throat> it's going to take you down here. And here in Download, you want to go for the, you're going to have three options. So what I usually do is I always download the, the biggest option, the one for 102 megabytes, because it contains... The entire program and the accurate ephemeris, uh, which is the planetary movements um, for many, many years to come. <laughs> and it has the atlas with 2.5 million cities so that you don't have to do it manually. It does it for you. So I like it. You go ahead and say download. And um, once you've downloaded it, uh, it's going to come over here to your download section. So what you want to do now is you want to go over here to your download section. Uh, I have my downloads folder. And once uh, Jagannath Aura is installed, you will see that the Code Weavers is going to pick up your Jagannath Aura icon. So you're going to go ahead and uh, double click on it. Um, you know, it's detecting that it can be installed in Jagannath Aura. So I'm just going to go ahead and do that and see what happens. Okay, so now this window pops open. And in this window, what we're going to want to do is you're going to want to go to the second tab. And go ahead and say Jagannath Hora full install.exe. And uh, you want to go ahead and click continue. Here in this list, you're going to want to move your cursor all the way down and just click on unlisted application and say continue. And then go ahead and say install. So once, um, you know, it's going to take a little while. It's a little process. Uh, you know, you go through it. And sure enough, uh, after the end of this process, you'll have a fully running Jagannath Aura. <coughs> Today, as we are recording this, um, you know, it's the coronavirus time. And um, I'm very happy to say that today, uh, gladly, the moon is in Aries and in the constellation of um, Ashwini. So, okay, so here we're having a... Okay, verify developer. So this is very important. So what you want to do if you get this right here, this, uh, 
you're going to get this little warning over here, which is basically your OS, uh, Mac OS, preventing you from installing bogus software. So you want to go over here to System Preferences, right? Please go ahead and open System Preferences. The box looks like this. You know this one. So what you want to do is you want to go over here to Security and Privacy, double click on it, open Security and Privacy, and you will see that here it says Jagannath Aura Full Install XA was blocked from us from use because it is not from an identified developer. So you want to go ahead and say allow anyway. Okay? And then you're going to go ahead and say open. All right? And then the, the installation is going to continue. So here we go. As I, I was telling you that as I'm making this video, uh, we have the Pratipat of 2020, April, May. Uh, 2020, the Pratipat follows in Ashbini Nakshatra. And so that means that uh, both the sun and the moon are in areas right now. And Mars happens to be exalted. So that's the good news of today. Ashbini marks the beginning of healing for the world. So it's the healing nakshatra. The Ashwini Kumaras, they're the healers in the zodiac. And so um, having a, you know, the moon cycle starting Ashwini is going to be very good for everybody. So very positive things. I think it's going to be a very positive 15 days of you're watching this. <clears throat> so uh, we're going to go ahead and say um, install Jagannathora. So here you have this little window that hasn't been updated since uh, <laughs> I think the first version of Jagannathora. <laughs> you see, it kind of looks like a Windows 98, like all retro and all cute. So, um, you know, do have in mind that this is not a, you know, a software that is done for aesthetics. It's just a like a very practical thing that, um, you know, a, a wonderful astrologer put together for us, but not a lot has been invested in you know, the graphic interface, uh, but nevertheless, it's still the the number one best software out there, in my opinion. So you want to go ahead and say next. Um, what makes it the best? The calculations and, and also the fact that it's free. And it has the name of Lord Jagannath on it. So Jai Jagannath. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and say accept the agreements. Go ahead and say next. Uh, program files, that's fine. We go ahead and say next. And uh, we click the final install button on this little cute Windows, uh, you know, interface that pops out here. Mac looks nothing like this. <laughs> so we're going to go ahead and say install. And um, so there it is. It's running. It takes a little while. Um, I'm installing it on a MacBook Air. So um, you should have no problem with it. Um, so there it goes, uh, little by little. It's installing, so um, please bear with me. I'm going to give you some advice uh, now on how to do the, um, you know, the change of interface. Uh, once you go into Jagannath Aura, there's a few things that I always like to do right off the bat that are going to help you in your, you know, in your process. So we'll go ahead and do that. So there it is. Uh, we're going to go ahead and finish. We're going to say goodbye to our, uh, you know, Windows interface and go back to lovely Mac OS. <laughs> say finish. And, um, and there you have it. So let's go ahead and close everything. And we're waiting for it to launch. There it is. Lord Jagannath appears. And so here, what you're going to notice when, you know, when the application launches is that, of course, you have like this very, very complex um you know, array of windows, which is, um, you know, the software is designed to give you a bird side view of all the divisional charts, which, um, you know, I like to have them to look at them, uh, you know, if I need them. But I usually go with Rashi and Navamsa only. So what I want to do is I'm going to turn off, uh, it's called a pack mode, and I'm going to uh, go ahead and turn it off so that I can just have Rashi and Navamsa. But before that, I would like to go to, um, you know, change this South Indian chart, which is the one with the squares. I want to change it for the North Indian chart. So we're going to go to Related to Display here under Preferences. We're going to go to Related to Display, Chart Style and Language. And here is where you can change it to the North Indian style. So we go ahead and we say yes, change to North Indian style, then we say OK. So what's going to happen is now you have this, um, you know, for those of you that like the North Indian style, the diamond style chart. So now you have it. So um, I'm, I'm very happy with that. Um, I'm ready to go. But before I go, um, 
you know, you want to go ahead and click here. So you, you want to hit command and, and the button or the secondary button in your mouse. Or if you are in a laptop, you can just tap with two fingers. And that's going to bring you this menu right here. So how I like to do it is I like to go ahead and say turn off packed chart mode. So you click on this uh, item here and you go ahead and say OK. And it says, uh, would you like to start Jagannathora? You go ahead and say yes. So usually it does automatically, but my experience is that since it's a Mac emulator, you got to go over here to the launch pad and then, um, you know, directly um, look for Jagannathora, which is right here. I always like to drag it over here to the, to the desktop and then click on it so that I can launch it again. And then, you know, what happens there is that... Uh, well, we wait for a little minute and then voila, Lord Jagannath is there. And so one of the things that you're going to want to do when you open your chart, um, and this is the final thing, is uh, you're going to want to come over here and say edit birth data. And you're going to want to go over here and put the city nearest to you. So, for example, in my case, it's Vilnius, Lithuania. So I'm going to go ahead and do that and say OK. And then in preferences, I'm going to say set current location as default. It's going to give me the confirmation. I'm going to go ahead and say OK. And um, this is going to be your city, wherever you are in the world. So it can be India or New York or, you know, uh, wherever you are. And then you're going to go ahead and say save preferences. So in that way, the next time you open your uh, your Jagannathora software, you're going to come directly to the um, to this window where automatically you have your natal city. One other thing that you might want to do is you want to go here to related to display and go to font size and adjustment. And you're going to want to go to adjust font size. So um, this is related to how you see your fonts here on this side related to how you see your fonts in the chart. So um, compared to the rest of the fonts, do you want the language fonts in charts to be bigger or smaller? So I like to make them much smaller. And then I say, OK. And then what happens is these here fit perfectly well in the little houses. So I'm going to go ahead, preferences, save preferences, so that the next time I open my software, voila, it'll be as I like it. So I hope this tutorial helps you uh, in your process with Jagannathora, and I hope that um, you know you can now run it in your Mac. Uh, if you like this tutorial, then uh, and if you would like to know a little more about Jagannathora, uh, please leave me in the comment what you would like to learn, also from astrology. What is it that you're looking to learn online? And perhaps I can make a little video for you. I enjoy making them. Uh, if you have any doubt about the Jagannathora software, please go ahead and. Leave me a comment below. If you like the video, uh, please give me a like and uh, please subscribe to the channel. It really helps me and, um, and my family. Uh, we run this YouTube channel together. So uh, with a lot of love and uh, respect for everybody, I wish you all peace and health. And um, finally, I would like to say, uh, Rade Rade, may the goddess of love bless your heart. Thank you for watching.